Hello, Fun Nation. My name is James, checking in here with team number 5460 at the first of Michigan District Championship. It's Strike Zone. Incredible robot, two district wins under their belt. So much to learn about, so much engineering marvels here. Here with me, I got Laura, Cameron, and Michael. Let's find out more on Behind the Bumpers. This video on fun is brought to you by viewers like you and also in partnership with the following. Andy Mark provides superior service with the reliability that teams expect. Check out their sport gearbox and ratchet sport options to their tried and true compliant wheels used by teams all over the world. From mechanical and electrical products to tools and hardware, head on over to andymark.com for your one-stop shop of high quality and affordable solutions. Build your alliance with so many other FIRST alumni who go to Kettering University. Every student at Kettering experiences their cutting-edge co-op programs that seamlessly blend the professional and academic worlds. Kettering co-ops are a fully immersive working experience at the leading edge of industry. Head on over to kettering.edu slash FIRST to learn more about their incredible programs and to get more information. All right, Cameron, can you tell me a little bit more about the mechanical features of your robot? How are you guys scoring? Yeah, so kind of a unique function of our robot is the whole double-sided arm thing. Um, that came from trying to possess two game pieces. Um, that was a pretty big priority from ours from day one. So starting up with the Coral Claw here, we just have a kind of standard uh, one wheel side. A unique thing about our, ge uh, our, climber, or our Coral Claw geometry is the uh, flexing of it. So the wheels actually just work to bring it in. It's just a funneling mechanism and the um, claw actually just flexes out and grabs it to hold it in. So that's kind of a unique function. We have a wrist right down here that's a Versa Planetary powered by a bag motor to actually act as our pivot. So we can do our wrist, grab from the station, score out one, and then everything else is pivoted right here. Working our way down to our arm, our arm joints SLS 3D printed. We had experience with that in the past and that was what we found worked well. We hold the carbon fiber tubes in with hot glue, which is something that we just do for repairability. It's kind of a unique feature for it. Um, working our way down to the algae claw here. It uses two wheels. This is something we, we've iterated on a lot. We have a bar back here that helps to keep us from torsioning, right? So when we grab, so when we grab a coral, we'd, or algae, sorry. We grab an algae, we don't have to worry about our wheels flexing out with the algae. It stays nice and stiff and rigid. And yeah, I think that's a, Pretty generic overview there. Nice. Laura, can you tell us a little bit more about this algae mechanism you guys have here as well as your climb? Yeah, so going into our intake, this is actually based off of our 2023 intake, where we are able to easily pick up the algae off the ground, which this also helps us with our climb. So at that end game, we push our intake all the way down, which deploys our climb, and we are able to go up to the cage, and we actually have a funnel mechanism that helps us align up to the cage, and then once it detects that we are lined up, the intakes will fold up and help us climb the cage, which at the first event we had, we actually had a different iteration of it where it was kind of inspired how linemen climb poles and it like climbed on to the side of it. And then we actually had trouble with the alignment, which is why we decided to try this after seeing other teams do it. And it seemed to work out really great for us and we haven't really seen any issues yet. Very impressive. Thank you, Laura. Handing it over to Michael now. Can we talk a little bit more about some of those control systems uh, that makes this robot really tick on the field? Yeah, so one of the main focuses with programming was to make everything as automated as possible. Uh, we have about two buttons that we mainly use. One that drives up to the reef to score coral, and we just press the button and it lines up and does everything. And another scores the coral. And then we also have a player station button that drives up to the player station, puts the arm out and everything. Um, we do this because it's a lot faster than having to manually line everything up. Very cool, thank you, Michael. Can you tell me a little bit more about the cameras? I see a limelight on there. What, like, are you using one, two? Like, what does that look like for you? We're using the limelight four. Um, we use them to know where we all are at all times. Uh, it locks onto the reef uh, when it has a coral so that it can always see the tag. And when we go to auto score, it never misses because it can always see where it is. Well, 5460 Strike Zone, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to us today. Incredible robot, very interesting to dive into. You guys are doing great here at MSC. Best of luck the rest of the weekend. And to all of you, my name is James for Fun Robotics Network. Thanks for watching. 
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the bell to stay up to date on future fun videos. Build your alliance with so many other FIRST alumni who go to Kettering University. Every student at Kettering experiences their cutting-edge co-op programs that seamlessly blend the professional and academic worlds. Kettering co-ops are a fully immersive working experience at the leading edge of industry. Head on over to kettering.edu slash FIRST to learn more about their incredible programs and to get more information. Animark provides superior service with the reliability that teams expect. Check out their sport gearbox and ratchet sport options to their tried and true compliant wheels used by teams all over the world. From mechanical and electrical products to tools and hardware, head on over to animark.com for your one-stop shop of high quality and affordable solutions.